Hey guys, Shane here, CryptoFish YouTube channel. So today we have a little Vidulum mining and review, and um, we'll see what my rigs did over the weekend. Back in a bit. All right, before we go on, I have something going on called Bitcoin Fridays, where I give away Bitcoin every Friday. So if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell below. So when the Enter to Win video comes out this week, you'll be notified. Okay, do that real quick. It takes just a second, couple clicks. All right, let's go ahead and check out what Vidulum is. All right, so um, last night I was watching the Technicals live stream. He does it every... Um, every Sunday night, but I'll have a link down to his channel below if you want to check it out. It's pretty enter entertaining. Uh, he brought up one of the coins in the uh, show called Vidulum, um, so I thought I'd go and check it out. I also got notified on my WinCoin app of uh, it coming out, so I thought I'd go check it out and try mining it. Here it is on Bitcoin Talk. Um, what does the Vidulum app offer? A web-based cryptocurrency wallet that supports multiple projects. Access from any compatible browser, integrated chat through VLink, exclusive control over your private keys, built in staking uh, of VDL via the vstaking feature, rock solid security. Uh, uses the Equihash algorithm, um, 200 underscore nine. Got 100 million total supply. So on the surface, it doesn't look too bad, only 2% free mine. Uh, where are we at? Here is the actual interface, vidulum.app. All of these links will be down below uh, in the uh, description, so don't worry about having to remember all of these. Uh, so how Vidulum works, you know, you can go, I'm not going to read through all this, but here are the wallets it's got. I think it's got, um, let me see if I can let me scroll down, but maybe it won't let me scroll down. But anyways, um, it's got 12, 14 different coins as of right now. Here's Bidulum. Um, so you basically can access your wallet slash wallets um, from anywhere in the world um, through just a browser, any old browser, which I thought was kind of neat. Not quite sure how secure that is, um, but they claim it's rock solid security, so I don't know. Um, but like I said, you know, you got different kinds of things on here. The usual Bitcoin, Zcash, there's a, there's Zellcash right there, huh? Six cents a coin right now. Anyways, so Vidulum, here's the interface. Um, it's got chat feature, fundraising feature. I don't think the staking feature is, um, available yet, but that's probably something they're working on still early in the, um, creation of the project, I guess. But this is what it looks like. So if you're going to find Vidulum, um, you just copy your address. These address will automatically be generated. So um, that's that. So to mine it, let's go back over here. And these will be all the miners will be right here. So we got four NVIDIA, CC miner, DSTM, and the B miner uh, for AMD. Uh, you got Genoil. I have never heard of that one. Zeke Miner, Zeke Classic Miner, uh, Claymore Miner, SG Miner, and Opta Miner. For the purposes of this video, I'm using the CC Miner. So you just click on that, download the um, Miner, and let me show you what it looks like. So when you download it, it's going to be right here, CC Miner. You've seen in other videos I've done. Um, you would just unzip that. And I called mine Vidula Miner. So you would go in here, double click, and you would create a run.bat file, which is right here. Again, this file will be down below. So don't worry about uh, trying to figure out and, you know, visually memorize all of this stuff. So you would just open up a notepad file. You would paste this in and save it as run.bat. And that's all you would have to do. Um, this pool right here. Let me uh, click the miner and start running it. So once you do that, save it as run.bat file and just double click on run and away it goes. It's easy as that. So the pool I'm using is the one recommended 
um, official pool vidulum.app pool.vidulum.app they do have a couple more but i'm just doing their official pool here it is right here um, as you can see i was mining it a little bit earlier then stopped and now i'm back on mining it i don't know how profitable it is of course it's not on any exchanges right now um, i've only got there's a balance 0 0.0065.019 immature so this is only on my 1050 ti uh, of course this laptop right now that's all I'm doing so it's not going to give me much let me see the souls right here only 82 souls right now of course that's probably because I'm recording it's going to be lower so let me go ahead and stop that but this is what the pool looks like um, again all these links will be down below so don't worry about trying to um, remember it here's a miner CC miner but again, just look below for all the um, different uh, miners information you need to mine it. So that's about it, guys. It's not a bad little interface on their site. You know, plenty of different coins, 14 different ones as of now. I'm sure they're going to be um, adding ones in the future. But it looks like a pretty neat little project. I like the fact that, you know, maybe you don't have your laptop or phone with you with all your wallets and everything else. Um, you can just log in from anywhere in the world, any browser, and as long as you got your coins transferred, some of it at least, your crypto, into their um, dashboard, you can access it from there and send and receive. I haven't seen, I haven't seen any other projects like this. Um, sure, there might be, um, but I haven't seen it. Um, it's not on any exchanges right now, so. Who knows what the actual price will be or when they're going to get on an exchange. Uh, like I said, it's a fairly new type project, so it'll take a bit for them to get on an exchange. All right, so my stats over the weekend. Got about 50 Zellcash so far, $3.36, 845 Stellite. Uh, Ethereum Classic, $6.88. I was mining Bitcoin Gold for a little bit. I still am. Um, because the price just shot up to almost $30 a coin right now. Um, I'm probably going to stop doing that. And maybe I might switch the NVIDIA rig here over to Vidulum and see how that goes for a little bit. But 11.70 so far this week. Total value minus 861.43. So that's only up about $12 over last week. So as long as it's going up, I'm fine with it. Um, so I guess that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell. If you have any questions or comments, to put them down below. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up. I'd appreciate it, guys. All right, see you in the next one.